हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल केमिकल्स फॉर्मुलेशन इन दिस चैनल वी विल लर्न प्रोसीजर एंड फॉर्मुलेशन ऑफ डिफरेंट टाइप ऑफ हाउस होल्ड प्रोडक्ट लाइक हैंड वॉश लिक्विड फेश वॉश लिक्विड टॉयलेट क्लीनर ग्लास क्लीनर कार वॉश शैम्पू रूम फ्रेशनर फ्लोर क्लीनर एंड एटसेट्रा सो काइंडली सब्सक्राइब this channel and also press the bell button to get notification so now starts today we will learn how to make dishwash liquid like branded dishwash liquid available in the market for making dishwash liquid we require these raw chemicals first is demineralized water we have to take demineralized water color we have to take food color or chemical color either color we can take for making this was liquid sodium hydroxide it's a flux of sodium hydroxide and it's also called as caustic soda sodium carbonate sodium carbonate and it's also called as soda ash lapsa it's a lapsa and it's also called it acid slurry fragrance you can take any fragrance but here i am taking lemon fragrance sodium laurel ether sulfate sls urea it's also called carbamite it's generally used in agricultural activity but it also used in chemicals reactions it's a sodium carbonate soda ash so friends from these chemicals we can easily make branded dishwash liquid i'm just take out this chemical like sodium hydroxide in this paper you can see and also i am just check out sodium carbonate from this water so friends now start the procedure first we have to take demineralized water and add color in it color you can take according to your choice either you can take light or you can take dark color according to your choice now we will add a 
सोडियम हाइड्रोक्साइड and mix it well We have to, we have to just, we have to just melt or it make soluble sodium hydroxide in this water. Now we have to add sodium carbonate. And also we have to just mix it well. I am also take out lapsa in this container and now we have to add lapsa in this compound. Now it's time to check the pH of the compound. For checking pH of the compound, you can take you can take pH paper. See, it's a pH paper, and you can also measure the pH of this compound by pH testing meter, and it should be between six to seven. Means in pH paper 6 to 7 indicates light green or you can also make it just no change means if you dip this paper if you dip, dip this paper in this compound 
the chemical the color of this paper will no change okay then you can say that the ph of this compound is balanced so now check what's the ph of this compound see the ph of compound is high and it's turned into dark green or blue so if the color of ph paper become dark green or blue we have to add some drop of lapsa in it means we have to add some drop of lapsa for balancing the ph see again color of paper become change again we have to add some now again we will check ph of the product see this time the color of ph paper not change means the compound is balanced now now we have to keep this compound for some time okay so just we cover it by paper and keep this compound for some time 